اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ثم بعثنا من بعدهم موسى و حارون الى فرعون و ملائه then we sent after them موسى و حارون to فرعون and his chiefs بی آیاتنا with our signs now here they mean they do big miracles فستقبرو they behaved arrogantly وَكَانُوا قَامَ مُجْرِمِينَ And they were a guilty people. فَلَمَّا جَاءُمُ الْحَقُّ مِنْ اِنْدِنَا We have read these things, you know, in detail. When the truth came to them from us, قَالُوا إِنَّا هَذَا لَسَيْرُ مُبِينَ They said it's a clear sorcery. It's a magic. قَالَ مُوسَىٰ أَتَقُولُونَ لِلْحَقِّ لَمَّا جَاءَكُمْ أَسْسِهْرٌ هَذَا Musa said to them, asked them, Are you saying this for the truth that has come to you? Is it, is it magic? Do you really think it is magic? وَلَا يُفْلِحُ السَّاهِرُونَ And the magicians, they will never succeed. قَالُوا وَجِهْتَنَا لِتَلْفِتَنَا عَمَّا وَجَدْنَا عَلَيْ عَبَانَ Now those chiefs and Fir'aun, what they said, Have you come to us? So as to turn us away from what we found our forefathers practicing. And the dominion in the land, they should be for you both. You are aspiring for power. You want to drive us from this land and to govern and control this land through your magic. وَمَا نَحْنُ لَكُمَا بِمُؤْمِنِينَ And we are not going to believe in both of you. وَقَالَ فِرْعَوْنُ اُتُونِي بِكُلِّ سَاحِرٍ عَلِيمٍ And said Fir'aun, bring to me every expert magician, whosoever is knowledgeable, sorcerer, call him, gather them. فَلَمَّا جَاءَ السَّحْرَةُ قَالَ لَهُمْ مُوسَىٰ أَلْقُمْ عَانْتُمْ الْقُونَ When the magicians and sorcerers came, Moses said to them, now you cast what you are to cast. فَلَمَّا أَلْقَوْ When they cast, قَالَ مُوسَىٰ مَا جَيْتُمْ بِهِ السَّحِرُ Musa said, what you have brought and what you have produced is real magic. It's magic. Nothing more. إِنَّ اللَّهَ سَيُبْتِلُهُ Very soon Allah will prove it to be false. Prove it to be vain. إِنَّ اللَّهَ لَا يُسْلِهُ عَمَلَ الْمُفْسِدِينَ Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala does not let the work of mischief mongers prosper. وَيُحِقُّ الْحَقَّ يُحِقُّ اللَّهُ الْحَقَّ بِكَلِمَاتِهِ And Allah will prove the truth to be true through His words. وَلَوْ كَرِهَ الْمُجْرِمُونَ Although the guilty people might not like it, they might abhor it. فَمَا آمَنَ بِمُوسَىٰ إِلَىٰ زُرِّيَتِهِ مِنْ قَوْمِهِ عَلَىٰ خَوْفٍ مِنْ فِرْعَوْنَ وَمَلَيْهِمْ This ayah is also one of the most misunderstood ayat of the Quran. Malayhim. Most of the people have translated as Malayhi. Malayhi is singular. Chiefs of Firan. Malayhim. Their chiefs. So this difference must be kept in mind. فَمَا مَنَا لِمُوسَىٰ إِلَّا زُرِّيَةٌ إِنْ قَوْمِهِ From his own nation also. Nobody believed in Moses except a few youth of his community. Now there is an important point to note. As I told you in the beginning of Surah At-Tawbah, that the advent of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam was twofold. Al-Baisat al-Khassa, Al-Baisat al-Amma. Khassa for the idolaters or pagan Arabs of the Arabian Peninsula. Amma to the whole of humanity for all time to come till the doomsday. In the same manner, Moses was also sent with double, you know, advent. He was a Rasul, full Rasul, full messenger towards Pharaoh and his chiefs. And also he was a Rasul to his own people. You will find in Surah Saf, وَقَدْ تَعْلَمُونَ أَنِّي رَسُولُ اللَّهِ إِلَيْكُمْ وَإِسْقَالَ مُوسَىٰ لِقَوْمِهِ 
لما توزونني وقد تعلمون اني رسول الله اليكم so there was two communities at that time the bani israel the children of israel which were oppressed persecuted badly and you know firaun and his chiefs they were the oppressors so musa was sent primarily to whom this must be noted his primary advent was towards firaun wa balai to the bani israel it was secondary and it was like the mission of a nabi that is why from them he never he, he never said believe me obey me or you will be destroyed this time you know this is the the way the messengers of allah have been saying to the communities or the nations to whom they were sent this he said to to firaun but not to bani israel bani israel you know some of them believed in him some of them helped him some of them you know at many a times they didn't accept his command refused just we have read in surah al-maida the whole of the nation refused to go to war but they were not said that now be ready you will be exterminated was it said to them no so there is difference his advent towards the firaun and his chiefs and his advent towards the bani israel fa ma amana le musa illa zurriyatun min qaumihi from his own community even from his own community none believed in him except some youth now this is the importance of the youth they must understand for any revolutionary struggle youth are the vanguard they have the courage the potential the older people you know they have to look to their you know maslahat what is to be done to wife family and this and that what will happen but youth they are relatively free whatever appeals them they accept it they are ready to sacrifice here also we find this word illa zurriyatun min qaumihi some youth from his nation ala khawfin min firaun wa malaihim due to fear from firaun and their own chiefs the chiefs of bani israel this is actually what should be understood and which has been not been understood by most of the mufassirin as well as the translators because they don't have this you know structure this political structure what happened in india for example the britishers were ruling us but then among us from among the indians they chose some people they gave them the title sir and khan bahadur and now these people were more loyal to the britishers than to their own nation and the biggest example is of karun karun was from bani israel but he was much near to Firaun, and he was against Moses. So actually, the people who are ruled, who are slaves, who are given to slavery, you know, their mentality changes. And people who are more cunning among them, they come near, they become more faithful. They serve the rulers, and they, you know, get the benefits out of them. So they become an oppressor medium. for the nation for their own nation they become the agents of imperialism although they belong to the oppressed nation but they becomes agents of the imperialists of the governors to suppress and control the governed people so this is actually mean firaun wa malaihim even their own chiefs because they were faithful they wanted to go and have a position in the court of firaun so they they should get a title from him maybe you know some jagir from him ay yaftanahum because they feared that firaun and their own chiefs will persecute them fa inna firaun al alim fil ard verily certainly firaun was tyrant on land wa innahu la min al musrifin and definitely he was from the extravagants wa qala musa ya qaum in kuntum amantum billahi fa alayhi tawakkalu in kuntum muslimin and so said musa alayhi salatu wassalam 
oh my people if you have belief in allah now note rasul is not mentioned here they were a community who believed in allah he has he is not mentioning himself here if you have real belief in allah fala tawakkalu so you must have faith in him in kuntum muslimin if you are real muslims if you have really submitted to allah faqalu ala allah tawakkal and they said okay we put our faith and trust in allah rabbana la taj'alna fitnatan lil qawmi zalimin oh our lord don't make us a vehicle of trial for these evil doers transgressors you know what does it mean fitnatan lil you have given them the freedom to persecute us you are trying them but on us you know but we call in urdu takhta e mashq don't make us takhta e mashq for these evil doers don't make us you know an article for they are testing you are testing their them on us so please wala tajalna fitnatan lil qawmi zalimin wala jana bi rahmataka min al qawmi kafirin and deliver us by your mercy through your mercy from these disbelieving people 